Virginia Tech taking on a Nebraska squad that had never beaten the top 15 team under Bo Pelini first quarter, and the Hokies get on the board first. Ryan Williams with a one-yard score. He had 107 yards on the day, but how about Nebraska's Alex Henry? Five field goals on the afternoon. The Cornhuskers led by two at the half on to the third quarter. Zach Lee, seventh in the nation in passing efficiency, looking for Mike McNeil in the end zone for the touchdown, but it's called back because of holding. So the drive continues moments later, first and goal, this time at the 21-yard line. Lee looking for Menelik Colt in the back of the end zone, makes the catch, but the referees say he didn't hold on to it. Take a look at the replay. Initially, Holt made the grab, but when he hit the ground, it came loose. No score. It remains 12-10. On to the fourth quarter now. Less than a minute and a half to go. Nebraska up 15-10. Tyrod Taylor going deep down the sidelines to Danny Cole, who hauls it in and goes 81 yards before he's taken out of bounds at the three. And that would set up this. Third and goal for Virginia Tech at the 33-yard line. Tyrod Taylor rolling to his left, then back to his right, trying to buy some time. Finally sends it into the end zone, looking for Dyrell Roberts, who makes the grab as the Hokies rally for the 16-15 victory over Nebraska.